They made their mark during last year's flooding on the Blanco River in Wimberley. Still a pretty devastated area uh, along Blanco River. Texar helped in the search for the nine Corpus Christi residents that were in a cabin swept away by a flash flood. Six-year-old Will Charba and four-year-old Leighton McComb are still missing and the team continues to search for them. Now, Texar wants to make the Coastal Bend their next place of recruitment. So, why Corpus Christi? The uh, response from the people in the Coastal Bend to go to Wimberley and to help the family, we have gained quite a few new members who showed up. They were spontaneous volunteers. Texar, short for Texas Search and Rescue, has five branches across Texas. Each chapter is a volunteer organization made up of locally trained first responders doing everything from disaster help to searching for missing people. Not only will the Corpus team be available, but the rest of the team members from across the state can respond as well. With nearly 200 members, Texar believes that having a coastal bend network will make all the difference when disaster strikes in our area. We stand ready to be deployed whenever we get the call. The coastal bend team would be able to respond and get there much more quickly 